all new at six. The search is on for the next superintendent who will lead one of the largest districts in Florida. The Pinellas County superintendent is stepping down this summer. And tonight, some community leaders tell ABC Action News reporter Sarah Hollenbeck they're making a big push for the next leader to come from a diverse background. Rick Davis has watched the Pinellas County School District come a long way in 30 years. Since his group, the Concerned Organization for the Quality Education of Black and Brown Students, began. Since then, we have made tremendous progress. Ten years ago, just 56% of African American students graduated high school in Pinellas County. Now that number is up to 86%. The good news is that we've made progress. We have made some measurable progress, but it hasn't been completely eliminated. We're on our way. It's going to take time. Davis just penned this letter in the Weekly Challenger. Tuesday, school board members will start narrowing down their criteria for the next district leader. And Davis hopes it's someone who will recognize the disparities between students. I don't know that it has to be a Hispanic or a black or African-American superintendent uh, in order to make the progress. I mean, Dr. Grego did well, in my opinion, uh, for the time that he's been here. But clearly, uh, a Hispanic or African-American or black superintendent is going to bring just that other dimension uh, to, the, to the work. The school board plans to spend the next two months gathering community feedback, and they hope to have a final candidate selected by June. They tell us narrowing the achievement gap will be a major focus of the next leader. Davis hopes to one day see 100% of Hispanic and African-American students getting a diploma and the teachers helping them to get there from diverse backgrounds as well. I think that that person has to come in uh, understanding the history, recognizing what we've done so far and try to help us kind of continue to make that progress. Outgoing Superintendent Michael Grego says that will be his focus too. We'll do a great job of, of finding that next person and we certainly will hold that person accountable too. I, I will too. In Pinellas County, Sarah Hollenbeck, ABC Action News.